Welcome back to XCOM and we're in a situation room and uh, we just saw a message actually on the uh, come up, let's see if it comes up again Successful incursion by mysterious operatives in South Africa bosses public confidence in government response been picking to up some odd transmission to uh, no, that's not it. There's one about the train thing that we did. Oh, here it is. About shadow operatives. Uh, commuter train diverted in China. A large alien ship inexplicably pursues. So that was about our last mission. And the situation room actually didn't change um, by doing that mission. We were hoping it would reduce panic, but um, it's just confused everyone by the things, by the looks of things. Um, well, aliens are confusing, of course. So again, we're in a very similar situation. No money, and we just need to pass time. Um, in the barracks, actually, we did change all of the um, like the loadouts of things so you now look the way you're supposed to. The only one that looks a bit different from the usual is fire hair. We can't change your red hair. So instead, of wearing, instead of wearing the death mask of an assault, we've left your hair open. You'll so. always be easily recognizable. Let's go to mission control and scan five days for a new satellite. And beam weapons. Oh, oh and the Heyman is back. Coming in from the council. Uh, at least we've got our healer back. <laughs> it is. <laughs> this is a council mission. Gangplank. With the hack signal in place, the alien battleship is vulnerable. And now is the time to strike. No, it's not. Everyone's injured. <laughs> we need to deploy a squad and set down on the ship's surface. It's a rare opportunity to retrieve the technology within the ship. We shouldn't waste it. Uh, he's got a point. <laughs> It'll give us some damaged components as well. Lots of missions, isn't there, on this um, month? But two scientists, two engineers, the reward. Not even reduce panic, which is what we really need. Where's the credits? We want the credits! Uh, yeah, yeah well. money to, yeah. Excellent. We look forward to seeing your progress. Okay, so we've got three snipers in here, that's no good. Surely. One heavy, that's at least something. Um. This guy has not got a medikit, so we should probably take the medikit off a of cheesy dog, right? Yep. Which is, he's now a heavy. So Sorry, change. cheesy dog. You're only a, a healer for a very short time, and uh, yeah. instead we're going to have Mr. Heyman here take the mantle. It's been a while since uh, Andy's been in mission. He was heavily injured a few episodes back. so. I think he was out for 18 days or so. And triple medikit, nice. Much better. Um, I'm not sure about taking all three snipers. So no, to be honest, uh, with the type of mission, I'd say we don't. will not take Tiger 007 and take another rookie along. Um, I was thinking we probably don't need two battle scanners in inside. So I was actually going to drop one of them, leave Tiger in. Okay. Uh, if so, then uh, change the scope. Uh, okay, so let's take Jeanette out, I think, who's been in a lot of missions. Sorry, Jeanette. Yep. And we're going to borrow your scope. You'll get it back later. And we'll give Tiger the scope. We'll have to remember then that Tiger doesn't have squad sight yet. Yeah, I just don't want um, Tiger to be too far behind when we do need him. So giving him some um, missions occasionally will be good. Uh, got True enough. Heavy rookie. That's Tanner Reps, isn't it? Yep. yep. We'll need another uh, rookie, I think. Uh, so we've got Curtis Mullet, Madam Peach, and Mrs. Mega Bosa. Um, I think let's take Madam Peach. Yep. Okay, looks good. Oh wait, our rookies aren't wearing their uh, cap and uh, headgear. Okay, okay. We definitely forgot to do that. Why? I'm not That's, sure. That's uh, hair helmet. Twenty-three. Uh, Something like that. It's one more. That's oh. the skin color. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Oh, was it free? Yeah. Uh, hair helmet twenty-three. No, it's not twenty-three. It oh. was twenty, I think. Yeah. My bad. Okay. Edit. Customize. 
That way they'll at least hear what's going on. There we go. Okay, let's get the show on the road. <laughs> this is going to be devastating again. <laughs> <laughs> well, I said that about last episode, it was going to go really badly, and it actually went really well, so... You're still hoping. We've got two snipers and we'll have to go in slowly. No uh, time pressure this time. Especially since mutons have been introduced. To China for the next operation. So destroying and disabling the power conduits will enable us to bring down the battleship without damaging it. And we have to eliminate all aliens. It really changed the setup uh, for these type of missions. Epic cutscene. Oh yeah. Big Sky took care of the delivery, but now comes the hard part. If we're going to set that battleship down intact, we'll have to start by disabling the power conduits positioned across its surface. Ah, it's the, uh, no what we're going to find it's the alien uh, vehicle of environment. From the alien cool. Forces manning that ship. Objectives updated. Okay. I don't know where any of this stuff is. There's multiple levels. There's one. You think that that's one? Yeah, I think so. And I think, by the way, they've positioned us, I think they're pointing us in that direction. Yeah, there's only one door here, it's not like they have a choice. <laughs> okay. Uh, the thing is, they've given us Madam Peach to begin with. Let's get him up to the door here, I think, and just on the side. Yeah. Let's open the door in the next turn when we've got everyone in position. And Alexander Snipers. We'll Snipers next to the door? Yeah. Well, this okay. sniper next to the door, and he can throw a battle scanner in. Good point. Um, Tiger can take up point just behind. Other side, I'd say. Oh. Ah. oh wait, that's a single move. He's got another move. The reason I said other side is because that way you've got snipers uh, crossing each other. You've got a view of a sniper in both directions. Then. Okay, that makes sense. Cheesy dog with his rocket launcher. Heavies inside alien spaceships when you want to steal the technology. Not always good for having <laughs> rockets and But later on, materials. you won't be going in without because, well, we've talked about it earlier. Uh, one of those upgrades that a heavy gets is 100% extra damage versus robotics. You'll need it. Um, let's get the, the healer over here, Andy, and. Oh no, sorry, this one's the healer. Oh no. He only did a short move, that's why I'm confused. It's over yeah, he's got sprint. Um, so, and then Tanner, the other rookie, can take this other side here. So there's not much we can do because the door's shut. At least we're a little bit set up. I'm expecting flyers here. Okay, let's open the door. Um, let's zoom in a bit so I don't mess this up. So that's the door open. And we've got a little bit of sight, but we can't see anything. So, let's give us even more sight by throwing a battle scanner down into whatever engine room this is. Eyes open. The conduit's positioned on the surface and of that we've got a hit. tied directly Nothing into the man. ship's power grid. If we can disable the conduits or destroy them with explosives, it should put that destroy thing out of commission, explosives. allowing Make us heavy to seize its down. cargo without the risk of collateral damage. Ah, throw a grenade or... Or, or just walk in manually yep. and take it. But seeing that we've got someone beside the door with a hand grenade, our... Uh, it's a bit I fast to throw, isn't it? Um, we could try. Um, Alright, if you think so. No, if we don't make it... No, never mind then. It was worth an attempt. It's only going to reach a little distance. Okay, let's get um, Tanner into a shot position, I think. Now, where's the stairs down? The soldiers, they'll jump down. True. Just keep keep him on the upper floor until the Tin Man is dead. I'm just worried. There's no time limit on this, so I think he maybe... No hurry. ...might be better. Yep. So I'll just do a short move in. And Overwatch, in case anyone triggers the alien. Um, mm -mm. Double cover over here with a sniper. Yep. Okay, 
Okay, still nothing new. This is um, our heavy. I might actually move him a bit nearer in so you can see over the edge. Yeah. Over on, oh, what's over here? The edge of the map. So I think maybe over here is kind of okay. Can you turn the camera around for a second, please? That's so not the edge of the map. There's a, a hallway there. That's the edge, edge of the map, but where that arch you can see, you can walk uh, past, I think. I think I'm still I'm happier going back here. Yeah. It's go time. So we've activated that alien. It's only a thin man. Oh wow. He's actually running. He went quite a distance actually. <laughs> um half cover there and take a shot if we're lucky. Okay, that's our healer. No, no shot, shot. there. Let's overwatch. Might get a shot after, and then here's our other rookie, Tanner. Um, now that he's moved there, I may take a position up down here. Um, that's it's high as the thin man is, so no defensive bonuses. It'll be fine. Double cover. True. Well, cover from both sides. Half cover. Yeah. Stay okay. alert, strike one. You've got hostile forces about to hit your position. Well, missed. Aha, missed. Beach, shoot back. Um, teleporting Ooh. aliens. And on Overwatch, even. Damn. And a sectoid. On Overwatch. But that one is, I think, on uh, wow. sniper range. Um, okay, well let's start off. Madam Peach has got a shot. 65% is good as well. Yeah, we'll take it. We'll have to look out for that sectoid that's on the other side, because he's on overwatch. Maybe the heavy can, uh, maybe the heavy has a shot. Or oh, the other rookie is up front, isn't he? Good point. Tana. Yep, let's see if we can get him a kill then. 85%? Yeah, oh, nice. Two? That's okay. And no shot, but no watch. I want to trigger it from someone who's far away, the overwatch, because then he's more likely to miss. Uh, doesn't the heavy have a shot? No. Well, maybe with rocket launcher. Um, I'd save that for later. Yeah. Seems a bit overkill on just a sectoid. And the conduit. Yeah, but the conduit you can also uh, deactivate by just clicking it uh, when someone's moved next to it. True. Hmm. We can move and shoot. Maybe move him down here. Yeah, we can try. It will trigger the Overwatch though. Uh, someone else will trigger it anyway. So. All right, let's just do it. There's the Overwatch shot. Whoa! Missed. Good. And now we get a shot back. 87%? Oh, definitely. Take that. There it goes. Okay, let's move someone else in to deactivate the power. Okay. Uh, Andy Heyman's our fastest, so he'll just drop down. Here they come. There's the overwatches. <laughs> miss, miss, miss. But if Andy sees him, that means our sniper might get a shot. He does. <laughs> Seventy-eight percent. Go need car. The, uh, Alexander, I think, is the first name. Yeah, I don't need the crit. It's just boom Straight across. Headshot. Very nice. And that leaves Tiger. Let's move Tiger in a bit as well. Maybe next to the other rookie? Well, I like or him up high because he is a sniper as well. So, perhaps over here, over watching the area? Yeah, it could work. Or, I don't even know. Our next one is over here, isn't it? Yep. So, we we'll have to get over there. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's through the poison. Let's not. 
Yeah, I'm just looking around, seeing our options. All right, now let's take him over this direction. Yep. Don't forget those blue uh, dots on the floor launch you upwards towards the next area. Oh, do they? Okay. We're receiving reports of heavy X-ray activity in that area. Enemy forces are likely closing on your location. With the Slenderman just ported in on Overwatch. And out of view as well. Yeah, okay. Let's get um, Andy here. Operating the control. Commander, whatever you just did seems to have stirred up the hornet's nest. The um, aliens are going to throw everything they've got at us to protect us. That's the gonna make him an easy shot for that two men over there. Yeah, did, uh, did you just get that message about us now stirring up the hornet's nest? Yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's aliens. Isn't there an alien somewhere at the back as well that put it in? Yep. A few turns back, a couple of turns ago. Okay, I'm going to move him out to the uh, this side, I think. Okay. Um, there's no cover. Alright, let's just dash him up top. Alright, get our rookie over. I, I don't want to go up just yet, do I? So maybe take this position here. Yep. Everyone needs to be running in because right now we're quite far away from each other, split up. Sniper here. Hmm, again, quite far away. I might bring him down to the bottom in half cover. It's not ideal for a sniper to be so low, but I don't think there's an easy way of crossing this ravine. Me neither. And our other sniper perhaps can take a sideways room. No, 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 not on his own. Well, we'll get that area has been ex hasn't been explored. That's suicide to go in on a. Uh, well, he's got another soldier down here. Look, see. So oh, I can join up here. Yeah. And in fact, here's the other soldier's turn now. See, shouldn't listen to you. You should go with my instinct. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You have instincts. Yeah, it's great. Um, okay. okay, there's half cover and full cover here, so take that position. There's that sectoid that landed. Yep. And out of overwatch. Oops. Ooh. Got flanked. But that sectoid is our business now. Okay, let's try with the rookies, see if we can get some kills in there. Guess we do. Nicely done, madam. Um, where's our healer at? Andy. Right there. There's Andy. Come and deal with this situation, please, Andy. Spray your white gunk all over him. Dude! <laughs> <laughs> what? There's no need for that. <laughs> Alright, let's head up top somehow. Otherwise we're going to get ourselves stuck. So, let's... Get him up here. Let's take him out. Oh, hey, oh, there's another thin man. And another. Oh, we knew that one from earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, do we have a shot on that, or did he run away? No, he's gone. I'm overwatching. Yep. Good idea. Sniper. Uh, let's get our sniper uh, somewhere upstairs. Um, oh. Uh, maybe next to the wall, so you can move up on the next round. Yeah, let's do that. And Tiger, that's the sniper I'm going to take on the um, side path here. So there's double cover here. Yep. And then he's got the backup from the heavy. He's also going to go flanking. There's a double cover spot a bit back next to the blue node. Yep. Yeah. Oh god, they 
take weird routes, don't they? Yeah. Heads up, boys and girls. Intel suggests hostiles are headed right for you. They're headed right for us. Got a lot of heat on me! Oh, miss. Good, good. They're destroying their own ship. I thought we were supposed to do that. Oh, new aliens. In Overwatch. Overwatch. I see a reaction shot coming. Oh, nice! <laughs> and a takedown. Well, there goes one of the dangerous Overwatches. Okay. Oh, it's one of. Oh, it's back by Tanium. Okay. Uh, the sniper first, I think. The sniper might actually have a shot. Possibly, but no. Tiger doesn't have a shot? Unfortunately. No. But he's not on Overwatch anymore, so. I might yeah. take this cover here. Thinking the same thing. Oh, Overwatch at the back. Yes. Oh, thank God for that really big wall over there. And he sees three aliens. Here. Oh. Which is good in a way, since now I can see what the hell's going on. Um, but now this other sniper, a tiger, that we said didn't have shots, he gets shot now. Oh no, because we haven't got squad sight for him yet. Nope. So let's come back to here. Right, so what have we got? 82%, 87%, and 67%. This one seems the most dangerous, though. Uh, it's definitely the most dangerous one right for that heavy. So yeah. let's take him out. No longer a threat. Okay. Seeing that the Overwatch have already triggered, we can move someone in a bit closer as well and take another shot. So, Tana, who's our... Uh, he can actually move to the other side of that column he's on and might have a shot on the one in the back. Right there, yeah. Okay, we'll try. Yeah. And it's flanked. Flanked? I'll take that. It's because he's barely got any cover. Tanner's. Nice. Alright, Madam Peach. He's got that double cover spot. Can he make that? This one. It's a sprint. Yeah, yeah but it's better than nothing. Yeah. That's what rookies are for, aren't they? Taking a risk till they get a decent job, yes. Okay, and sniper needs to be useful. So completely on top. Uh, there's another height elevation. Oh, there it is, and it's got cover. Oh yeah, we'll take that. He's got sight, but um, we could shoot the pistol or just stick him. Yeah. Let's try, take a try with the pistol. You never know, it might crit. 100%. One damage, yay! <laughs> okay, and now our other sniper needs to get some action. Now we, we can, can sprint uh, up and take this position. I was thinking the same thing. Let's do that right now. Run, Tiger, run. That's what your race is famous for. Isn't that cheaters? Good point. Not cheating. Cheetahs, as in Seems I'm wait. not much of a cat person. No, I'm um, gonna get the healer up a little bit. Yeah, I keep him out of danger so far. Overwatch? Overwatch, yep. Oh, Overwatch is triggered. Missed. Oh, oh no. unfortunately. Could have really done quite with close that. to that rookie over there. <laughs> Hello! Oh, God. <laughs> Damage? What the hell? Uh, um, don't shoot! Uh, don't shoot. Remember, it's a thin man. I know, I know. <laughs> Alright, let's back up a little bit, shall we? Or just a bit further ahead. Well, this works as well. And take Maybe our shot. Oh, you're right. I should have moved further ahead because now he's trapped behind the poison cloud. Uh, um, yeah. Okay. We'll move him through the middle in a bit. Let's, let's move over to the conduit. Yeah, I was just about to say that. I've been playing Mass Effect 1 again for a bit, so um, Conduit really has a different meaning for me at the moment. It's a big part of the storyline there. Look at the uh, background where we're flying over the city. Yeah, awesome. I've been looking at it for a bit now. It looks really good. It's a big city though. All the time we've been busy, we're still floating over a city. Okay. Or is the trick just running circles through, uh, through the city? Could be that as well. I quite like our tactic of this flanking maneuver, so I'm going to take this sniper and bring him down here. Yep. How low can you go? 
Oh, don't slip into the alien blood over there. <laughs> um, there's no cover around here for the... Center of the middle then. Uh, the middle block and then uh, the left corner. A bit more upwards. Uh, to the left of the conduit, I mean. Here? No, on the other side. Over here? Oh, no, 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 I see what so Yeah, I see what you mean. Uh, single move and a reload then. Yeah, you're right. He does need a reload. Back in. Okay, then our healer can make a dash for the front. Come on in, Andy. And Tana could really do a reload as well. Yeah, she can move as well then. Is there some cover somewhere? Uh, we'll just have to take a risk then. Yeah. Just start moving him down the ramp. I'm a bit worried about that because alien teleports in. So I'm actually just going to do it on the spot. Uh, they never are allowed to attack on the round that they turn up. Um, okay. Sure. I'm pretty sure. Tana, if you die, it's Malinka's fault. Just so yep, clear. I'll take all responsibility for killing a rookie. Back online. Just received some intel that hostiles are advancing on your location. Ready up. Okay, here's the teleport. <gasps> Chrysalids. Yeah, let's start shooting them. Um, Madam Peach is in a really bad place. I don't care about Madame Peach at the moment. I want every sniper shooting that thing. <laughs> All right, we'll come back. Uh, let's see. Um, shot. Tanner has shot. Let's operate. Shot. Is that conduit is down. True. It might be faster if our troops just hit the others with explosives. No shot, but let's see who else has shot from their current position. I might do something else with his turn. Good work. We found one other one down there. Sector or Thin Man. I think a Thin Man. Yeah. Okay, it's behind the door, so I'm feeling fairly s safe. Yep. Now, the Chrysalid can't jump over this gap, can he? So I can just... Um, I'm not willing to tempt that. Right. I love this stuff. you got to be ready. Really it's a sniper. Things. It's only got a pistol shot now. Yeah. Well, he ran, so he couldn't take a shot anyway. I'm trying to look at this guy's route up, he's actually over here. So we need to have a field of fire. Yep. Which they do move fairly fast, but I don't think quick enough to get all the way there. So I'll move another dash here. GG Dark, if you die, it's fire's fault. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's got a shot. He does. Let's uh, take it. So our healer's going to take a first pot shot at the chrysalid. Free damage? I'll take that. No, no, no. Let's him take it. Right. Tanner's not in the best spot right now, so I'm going to no, um, move to this half cover. Yeah, and he might even get a shot. Yeah. Unfortunately, he doesn't. But Overwatch will probably gain him a shot. Madam Peach. Oh. Uh, I think he needs to go straight to the middle where we... Uh, yeah, that one. We'll get you in on the action again soon. Adam. Oh, there's our watch. As I said, I knew he had a long way to run to get here, so it should be okay. Double move. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Single and move, and he might actually get that shot. Yeah, Adam, you managed to get round behind the crystal. Take the shot. He'll need to reload on the next move. Nice! I worked out in the end for Adam. Yep. Okay. Um, uh, Let's hunt up at the uh, Thin Man we see on the left. Yeah. But that has to be up by the door, so... Um, I'm just going to change of tact, actually. We've got Tiger down here. He's going to do a single move and um, open the door. <laughs> Now anyone else who comes down this way Contact. gets shots. 
Unless he runs away, which they are known to do. Yeah. Like that. But that's okay, I don't like that, so we'll just hunker down over here. Oh, unless, just because he's in a dangerous spot, maybe he's better if I move him backwards. Now he's activated the door. Yeah, agreed. Let's just get him covered here. Uh, oh, we've got a shot here from Cheesy Dog. It's not the best shot in the world, but I think No, it's but okay. it's quite decent. Nope. Shot wide. Well, they are thin. It's uh, quite difficult to hit uh, such a small target. Okay, so here's our healer. Move him close to the door. Trying to find a good spot. There isn't many. Because they have to actually run all the way around. She's, the tactic we use against Chrysalid is now working kind of against us. Yeah, let's move him over there. Tanner seems to be. Tanner could, could move next to that uh, heavy and take a, a second shot. True. Let's do it. 65. Yes. That was a hit. And a kill. Oh, Tanner, nice job. He won't be a rookie he's, after this mission. He's definitely the hero of the moment. Uh, single move and a reload, unfortunately. Yep. Okay, let's just... Let's send him through the right or the left. Well, if I just send him up through the middle, he can jump down. Um, but it does give him a reload action. Yep. We've got two doors. Hmm. Do we want to use one Double group? Uh, yeah. Oh, we, oh, we actually need to do both of them. I think there's a conduit uh, behind each door. A uh, smart move then is probably group uh, everyone up on one door and do them one at a time. We can't get a read on that thing. It's what so the hell? A, a cyber disc?